What is up everybody? Yesterday was the 8th of March and the whole world was celebrating International Women's Day. Following the occasion, we decided to arrange a real battle between some of the most famous football wives on the planet. Have you already guessed who we are talking about? Please welcome Georgina Rodriguez and Antonella Racuzzo. Crowds of fans could follow these beauties, but their destiny is to be next to the best footballers on the planet. Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi. In five rounds, we will decide who is the coolest girl in football. And no, no, we will definitely not consider skills with the ball today. After all, Georgie and Anto are not about that. But we are to tell you something equally interesting. Well, first, give a like to this video, subscribe to our channel, and let's get going! Let's say right off the bat. This point is a little subjective, but we will still try to make a comparison. Although it's difficult to somehow compare the girls because you just can't take your eyes off both of them. It would seem that Antonella and Georgina should be alike. Both have dark hair, brown eyes, dark skin, and an excellent figure. However, they seem to be two opposites, and at the same time both are incredibly gorgeous. What parameters should we choose to compare honestly? Weight and height data are changing from source to source. For example, Georgina is credited with both 54 kg and 62, and height fluctuates at around 168-170 cm. It is not clear what height Antonella has. Some claim that her height is 157 cm, then some suddenly add 8 more to this mark and it turns out to be 165. Well, that is no good. We will sort it out according to the classic parameters of beauty itself. Which of the ladies is closer to the cherished 90-60-90? If we believe the publishers which are specializing on the life of celebrities, then Georgina's parameters are 84-60-88. These figures differ from the standards by 6 points. Now, Antonella's parameters are 89-64-91. And here we get the same six points. Well, still nothing to note. Let each of the girls get a point, but we will still find out who is cooler in the next rounds. After all, beauty is not the only advantage of them. And only one thing in the first round for sure. For their husbands, Georgina and Antonella are certainly the most astonishing on the planet. Both Messi's wife and Ronaldo's girlfriend actively use Instagram. The girls have about the same number of posts, but there is a huge gap in the number of subscribers. Now, on the Instagram page of Georgina, there is almost 24 million subscribers. And on the Instagram of Antonella, only 13.3 million. Both decided not to start official Twitter and Facebook, since Instagram is enough for them. But how did it happen that both ladies are extremely popular but have such a large subscriber gap? We think the secret is simple. Antonella has almost no spicy photos on Instagram, mostly children, family, joint photos with Leo and some very nice portraits. Georgina, on the other hand, regularly pleases subscribers with a variety of photographs, showing her figure in all of its glory. Shooting for magazines? Here they are! Sexy workout pics? Of course, take two. At the same time, she also has cute pictures of family breakfasts and home photos with children. So, Antonella's profile will be a little more boring. She has less subscribers, so we give Georgina one point in this round. Do you follow any of them on Instagram? Write in the comments below whose profile you find more interesting. Now let's figure out what sort of jobs these hotties have and how they spend their routine. Already in Argentina, Antonella managed to get an education. Initially, she dreamed of a career as a dentist, but something went wrong at the university and she had to change the direction of her studies. The media wrote that the Argentina also studied social communication. Her education process had to be interrupted after she began dating Leo, but in the end, the girl still received her diploma. Although she hardly managed to work in her profession, the main part of Antonella's life is children. She constantly uploads photos with them and lives the life of a happy mother. After all, this is not as easy to deal with such little hooligans like the Messi brothers. 
In 2017, Antonella started doing business. Together with the wife of Luis Suarez, Sophie Balbi, she opened a boutique of branded shoes from the designer Sarkani in the center of Barcelona. Now little is heard about the store, but we hope that the business continues to bring profit and only positive emotions to Antonella and Sophie. Georgina also has a family and raising four children in the first place. But this girl manages to build her modeling career. Before meeting Cristiano, Georgie was a dancer. But she had to live it. It became too expensive for her. The girl had to work as a waitress, saleswoman, governess, in short, whoever she accepted. Also, Rodriguez made her first steps in the modeling business, but not very successfully. After Gucci brought Georgina and Cristiano together, she decided, why not take up modeling seriously? She signed a contract with Una Models Agency, began to appear at large social events, and began to appear more and more on the covers of magazines. Now Georgina is not only a mother, but also a successful model. She advertised underwear, sportswear, and swimwear, as well as a variety of cosmetics. Rodriguez also launched her own clothing brand this year. The first collection is expected to show up in April, but for now we can take a look at the sweatshirt and the sweatpants with the Om Baiji logo. How Georgina keeps up with everything? It's no surprise that Superman Cristiano Ronaldo has such a super girl. Anyway, the point in this round certainly goes to her. The time has come to compare the amorous affairs. Which of the ladies knew their loved ones earlier? Georgina and Cristiano met in 2016 and started dating quickly enough. It seemed to many that this relationship was a fake one, and how could Irina Sheik be swept for some Spanish woman? But quickly enough, the couple got themselves a common child and confirmed the seriousness of the relationship. According to rumors, Cristiano has already proposed to Georgina, but so far, everything is at the level of gossip. They haven't yet played the wedding, because if this happened, the whole world would definitely know about it. Antonella has been with her man for much longer. She and Leo have known each other almost from early childhood, because Anto is the sister of Leo's friend. In 2000, Messi had to move to Barcelona, and they parted ways. But a few years later, Lionel and Antonella started dating again. Since then, they have never parted. The couple got married only 10 years after the start of official relations. For a long, strong and legitimate relationship with her husband, Antonella wins in this category. Both Georgina and Antonella are mothers with many children. Both girls love and adore them. Georgina and Cristiano have four, but only Alana Martina is their common child. Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. was born back in 2010 from a surrogate mother. In 2017, Cristiano became a father once again. Then he had already dated with Georgina, but the twins Eva and Matteo was also from the surrogate mother. A few months later, Alana Martina was born. This is Georgina's own daughter. However, Georgina will certainly be able to become a mother more than once. Cristiano loves the number 7 very much, so it is possible that he won't stop at 4 kids. Moreover, he and Georgie have only one common child so far. Undoubtedly, my family is the main thing for me. My children and my husband are above all. I care a lot about them, and my heart is overwhelmed by them. It is full of love, said Georgina in a recent interview. 33-year-old Antonella is the mother of three sons. She has long known firsthand about what motherhood is, and it looks like she really likes it. The eldest son, Tiago, was born in 2012, Matteo in 2015, and Chiro in 2018. For the birth of three little boys, we give Antonella one more point and are proud of her. Total score, 33. We have a draw here. No, really, it is just impossible to make choice between two of these girls. What kind of relationship do Georgina and Antonella have with each other? They can hardly be called best friends, but on Instagram they are subscribed to each other. Sometimes they even comment on each other's photos. Last year, Georgina reacted to Antonella's congratulations on Easter, and also congratulated Tiago Messi on his birthday. 
What fast grow? Happinesses, wrote Georgina. Antonella responded with emojis. Both beauties are incredibly attractive and both are great for their husbands. Georgina seemed to be created for Cristiano and Antonella gets along perfectly with Leo. Who do you think won this battle? Let us know in the comments below. It was Inside Football. We watch football from a different angle. Have a nice one and see you in a bit.